Alright, today we're doing the second video on how we can, uh, how you can get free money um, without actually having to work. This is called the Savings Catcher from Walmart. And it's an app that you can download on your phone. Um, and what it does is when you are shopping, I don't know if you can see it, the little Walmart app right there, you click on it. When you are shopping, while it's booting, I'll tell you, when you are shopping, you get your receipt. You can see the Walmart receipt. And at the bottom, it has the, what is it, QR? The QR code. QR code. And it has the barcode right here. What this app does is you will scroll to where you'll see the little pig. It's a little outline of the pig that says Savings Catcher. It's like a piggy bank. It's like a little piggy bank, yeah. You will click on it. Wait for it to load. And it has two options. One in the blue says launch Walmart Pay. We'll get back to that in just a second. The one that you want is called, it, it has in there, scan a Walmart receipt. You will click on it. And it comes up with the screen. You can see the little box that's real clear. And you want to be able to, Ooh. what? I zoom too far in. To put now your... We need to uh, do this on your phone because oh. mine's full. Mine's got the seven. Explain about the, the seven. The seven receipts is all you're allowed to scan for one week. That's seven days. I'm already at my limit, and I'll explain that in just a minute. We're going to get my, my wife's phone and do it. Get it on that screen if you don't mind. Sorry for the pause. She's booting hers up, loading hers up, whatever you want to call it. All right. I'm going to hold it up here close to the camera where you can see what's happening. Hang on, we're going to scan the receipt right there. And then at this screen, go for it. Move it up. Up. Up, like this? Yeah, okay, and that's too far. Hang on. Thanks for your receipt. We got it. All right. And now you hit the got it button. It says my reward dollars are zero. Uh, I thought I had I, almost a dollar. I, it, it'll, it'll show back. It'll show back. Here. But anyway, um, what it does is all the items that is on the receipt <clears throat> that have been purchased, their, their uh, data banks will go over it. Did I say that right? It'll go around through all of the competitors' shop, you know, the places that sell groceries or whatever these items are. And if they have them cheaper somewhere else than Walmart, Walmart will refund you the difference uh, between the two, you know, the two places. And it will add. You can let it sit there and just continue to add and build uh, until you actually use it, which comes in handy, let me tell you. There's been so many times that we have had like two or three days left to go before payday and um, we had no groceries and we had a few dollars or know, no dog the, food <laughs> or no dog food that's been the problem <laughs> and uh, we've had a few on the, the savings catcher and we get our plus we've, we've gotten like 80 some dollars worth of groceries free due to the savings catcher another thing that you can do what I do all the time in the parking lot you can scan it doesn't necessarily have to be your receipt. You can find them blowing around on the parking lot. Look where the trash builds up, like in the corners of the actual building. And the, Look in and there. the carts. And the carts, yeah, mainly in the carts. Because people will just, receipts don't mean nothing to them. They'll just water them up and throw them in the, the cart. You can get them. But you can only do seven a week. So if you are married, set your spouse's phone up also with her you know their account hers or his account whoever um, and that way you can scan another seven receipts that's 14 receipts now when you have picked up receipts out of the parking lot what's the most you've ever gotten from any one receipt there was one receipt it doesn't matter well, even from your receipts or from yeah, picked up ones there, there's one um, <laughs> one time I got almost $10 off of one receipt. 
which the receipt ended up being like 300 something dollars, but 200 of that was one item. And apparently it was cheaper somewhere else. So you get that difference. Um, but you could, don't, if it's like two or three items on there, don't think, oh, well this receipt ain't gonna count. One, one thing that was under $10, one receipt was under $10. I got over a dollar back on that receipt. So don't, don't look at it as, well, there wasn't very much spent. That particular item that didn't cost very much may be cheaper. You will get the difference. You know, it, it may be cheaper somewhere else, and you will get the difference uh, from Walmart. But anyway, uh, all right, we're going to go over the actual payout of the savings catcher for Walmart. I'm waiting until it boots up. <coughs> what you do is it'll give you the amount, shows you how much you have in your your uh, the rewards dollars. Mine actually is twenty one dollars, which is awesome. Hey, dog, Mr. Anderson. Oh, Mr. Here. Anderson. Oh, here. That's our dog, by the way, Mr. Anderson. But anyway, what you do is the 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 first one that I said that we get back to, oh, where it says launch Walmart Pay. You click on it, and when you are in, let's see, I still need to figure out what. Here, give it to me. I think when you're in line and you're ready to cash out, you know the little monitor that's showing. You know when All the right. items right. are scanned, it's it gives go. you a, a an ongoing total. Oh, excuse me, sorry about that. And it has the the QR code that is on the screen. This screen right here, what you do, you can see with the white in the background. I don't know. You have to. It's all just I, okay. What about now? There you go. Okay. Yeah. Is it is it able to be seen? Yeah. It, yeah. All right. You want the QR code that's on that screen <laughs> in that box, and if you have reward dollars in your account, it will automatically go to take off your balance just by scanning it on that QR code on that screen. Also, and I don't think Rusty knows this, you can connect your own credit or debit card with this app. And then when you're at Walmart, you don't have to have your card with you. You can just pay with this Walmart pay and it, it'll use your balance from your savings catcher first if you have one. When that is used up, then it will apply the remaining balance to whatever card you have connected to the app. Which is pretty cool. It's very handy sometimes if, like us, you only have one debit card and uh, someone else has it and it's not at Walmart with you. All right. But anyway, that's how you get your money out. It, it used to be where it was transferred onto either a, a Walmart gift card, here, a Walmart gift card, or um, a Bluebird card, which I'm not going to go into detail. It was like a Visa. American Armas, Express. American Express card. Bluebird is. Uh, but anyway, they bypassed that and made it where they just put that screen on there that will scan that QR code and it automatically, which is a lot easier than trying to have another card and you always have your phone, hopefully you always have your phone and with you, so it saves a lot of, you know, in between stuff that you have to do. So anyway, that's, that's pretty much a wrap on uh, the savings catcher for Walmart. I hope that has helped. Um, free money is always a good thing. <clears throat> and if I can help people, we're going to. So keep that in mind. I hope y'all give this uh, video a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, we try to do different videos. Please subscribe and click the bell for notifications of newer videos. We're going to try to come up with something different every week. Until next time, thank you.